Hey guys, yes, I am making a short little video on my bed. Uh, I've just bought a new little critter's enclosure with a nice little, I call it my Groot skull. It looks like a little wooden forest skull. It looks freaking awesome. Um, but yeah, I'm just setting up a new spider enclosure for my tarantula. I'm going to wait till it gets a bit bigger. Uh, and in the meanwhile, I can just buy and add little things. Um, but this is the main setup. I want to get maybe... Um, Maybe a small piece, very small piece, of a uh, cork bark for the isopods. Because uh, I'm going to put some isopods in here as well. Um, at the moment, I've just got some springtails, which I'm going to be adding in today. Uh, and this is just the first little setup. I want to put some plants here, because you can actually plant at the top of the skull. And uh, yeah, just get some plants here. Hopefully, uh, Frankie will make his home inside the skull eventually. Because um, that can be his little hide. But yeah, today is just the first little look, and we're going to be adding L spring tiles. I'm just going to go take the lid off. going to add the substrate straight in with the springtails now should be a load of them in there Give it a good tap in and then uh, yeah as you can see they're sort of running around i'm going to put the lid on the box just in case there might be some left and um, but yeah they should start making a little home inside there now apparently they seem to be a bit jumpy i don't know if they're jumping up I'm just losing my mind, but yeah, there is springtails in there, starting to uh, make their little home. I'm just going to spray off this here, um, as it did get quite a bit of the springtail dirt on it. Um, I'm sure it's going to get muddy anyway over time, but I'm about to try and keep it semi clean. Okay. There's plenty of moisture in there. I did spray everything down beforehand and just give it a quick rinse with reptile safe water. Uh, so yeah, here we go. This is the start of the enclosure, getting it ready for the tarantula. I'm going to add some wood lice, some cork bark, um, maybe a very, very small dish in the corner or something for the water. I don't think if it needs it yet, it's still not quite big enough um, to have a water dish. I don't want it to drown, but yeah. Main thing is keeping it nice and humid for all my tarantula. Uh, I'm probably going to wait till it does a molt, let it calm down after it molt, after it molts harden up a bit, and then uh, we'll be transferring Frank or Frankie into the enclosure. <laughs> 